We on? Mm-hmm. All right. Um, guys, I'm going to do the whole, my whole back care routine. It's going to be um, a couple reps of the um, Qigong wall squats, followed by the Qigong waist twister, followed by upward dog, downward dog. Um, perfect warm-up, actually. It's a full body warm-up, but it's just great for um, taking care of your back, particularly your low back. Of course, it also has um, energetic, spiritual benefits of opening up the uh, dantines, as they're called in uh, Taoism, which is our energy centers, or in the Vedantic tradition, uh, help opening up the chakra system for the flowing of Kundalini energy. Um, as you can see now, as opposed to my last video doing this, um, my feet are narrower. As I'm uh, working with this again, I started out wide and I'm getting my feet closer and closer together. And I'm going to work my way closer to the wall with each set. So you can expect the pretty, pretty, pretty big possibility of me falling on my butt. Um, so. Please don't. And by the way, my lovely assistant is here to say hi. Today. Hi. See? All right. So, rep number one. Um, my feet are closer together than before. I'm not too far away from the from the wall. Enough room to move. I'm going to pull myself down. I'm not just squatting down. I'm literally as if someone's grabbing the hold from behind and pulling me down. Um, I'm going to use my breath to help me do so. So I breathe in. I'm holding my breath. Exhale. Slightly hugging my, shoulder, my knees. And you can see... I'm coming up in a wave. One rep. A little bit closer. Feet are still together. Eventually, I'm going to have my feet all the way together. Breathing in. Coming up in a wave. All right. I'm going to do another rep in that same spot. Straight. I'm going to inch just a little bit closer. Coming up in a way. One more. This one's going to be tough. It's going to be a little close. This is just about at my um, best. Maybe a little bit closer than I've done it. In my prime, I did it completely up against the wall. So I don't quite have that flexibility of the spine that I have. Not to say that I won't have it again um, before I do this last rep. The key to doing this, the key to back hill, don't just do this to see if you feel better afterwards. Commit to the practice. Do it every day. I actually do this multiple times a day, almost in the grease to groove fashion, where a couple times a day as I pass the wall, come up and I do that and it has helped my back quite a bit just in the past um, week or so that I've been reworking on this stand up in a wave that close to falling on my butt all right and we want a shot of Misty she made her presence known last time just her nose this is the old boat missing. Speaking to the camera. All right, two more things. 